Generic greetings and welcome back to RimWorld where a bit of ship landed which is full of poison. It kills 99% of everything. Um, actually that's the percentage of health but either way it's full of poison and that is generally considered to be bad. It will spread and kill everything around there and I'll kill all of the, um, the trees and the bushes and such and I assume that animals going through it would not have a good time either. The problem is that A, it's full of poison and when we attack it, it's going to defend itself via unknown means and also apparently it has a wounded buffalo and wind tunnel inside it. Hmm, there's something not quite right about that. So what I'm going to do is speed this up and I'm going to let the fires die down. They should slowly die down as it goes by. It is quite cold, so the uh, propagation of the fire and the spreading of it shouldn't be as much as it ought to be. You can see it's actually uh, <laughs> heating this up and there's a bit of rain as well. So, what we need to do is deal with it, and we need to deal with it sooner rather than later. So we'll wait for everybody to wake up, and then we'll send them off to go and do something. I'm just going to check everybody to make sure that they're armed. Cougar wasn't armed. I'm going to give them... Uh, let's have a look. Ugh, no skills at all. So probably the machine pistol and just uh, hope to look out. There we go. So, let's get everybody up, draft, and we'll get over there. So... I've not told them to attack it straight away because I want to, um, I want to split them up. So, it says it will defend itself. Now, I have no idea how it will do that. I assume that it will not fling out any sort of turrets or anything like that. I don't think that's, uh, what it meant. It'll probably be some sort of robot. Or multiples. It could be multiple robots. I don't actually know just yet. We're going to find out, aren't we? So, I'm going to put people in positions of cover, um... So, like that, and Cougar can go... Uh, Cougar needs to really be the closest. So, Land can go there, Purple can go there, Cougar can go there, and then the melee is all around here. Um, like that. So, everybody is looking at this from different angles. We will attack it, and then we'll see what we get. So, we'll do that. I'll order them to do that, and then I'll order these just to go uh, there. And immediately, we get a centipede. A centipede. Heavy combat mechanoids that glide on dozens of tiny legs. Their thick carapace and firepower makes them very effective against bunched up and static defenders. They are somewhat vulnerable to mobile hit and run tactics. So they have a big gun. I'm going to melee assault that. All of these can start shooting at it. We can get Diver to shoot at that. Um, like so. Why can't I? Hit? I can't. I'm going to have to move closer, I think. Um, and Nicole can move closer as well. And we can hope to deal with this thing. So normally when you get ranged things like this, the best option is just to get closer and uh, take it on like so. The problem we have is that things like Cougar and Purple are absolutely terrible shots in every way and we're probably going to end up hitting our own uh, when we're doing this. So let's bring them a little bit closer there like so. And already Caro has taken some hits. We can see that they are um, bruised so we do need to sort that out. Um, it's, it's, it's very, very, very much however a a mini point. I mean, I don't really care too much if they're getting bruised. Why is Cougar damaged? Um, gunshot bolt action rifle. It's from Henriette, isn't it? I'm sure it is. They're gonna die in 22 hours. Diver. No, diver from behind. To be fair, they are in the direct line of fire, so maybe moving them is the best course of action. Whoa! They, they need to shot them as well, so let's let's stop that. In fact, you know what? Just, just attack the big ship. Uh, oh, Lokuga's directly in the way as well. And that has now been dealt with. Right, everybody assault the ship. <laughs> so I'll get closer to it. Um, this could be all kinds of bad. I'm doing this. And I have no idea whether or not this thing blows up when you uh, take it out. You don't know until you know, and I guess we're going to find out. And it doesn't blow up. It just, uh, it just... Uh, disassembles itself into component parts, which happens to be steel at times 100, a plasteel 35 of, four components, and an advanced component. Excellent. We also have the uh, mechanoid there as well that we can salvage from our uh, table here. So we can go for bills and to disassemble mechanoid, and we'll say do a number of times equal to forever. Cool. Um, The problem, though, is we, I reckon we can't haul that. So we can haul the advanced components, we can haul that component, we can haul that component, we can haul that component, we can haul that, but we cannot haul the mechanoid. No empty accessible slot. Okay, what I'll do then is I'll have that set to accept mechanoid corpses. And 
then I will say prioritize swallowing centipede and then we'll unpause it and they'll crack on and go back and do whatever they need to do which most of them is to go to bed and then um, hopefully uh, not die so let's set all these to medical um, we did have obviously some medical treatment needed here uh, they're going to go back there so caro yeah bruise see that heavy charge blaster bruise that's fine a bruise is fine cougar that's bad Blood loss minor, dying 19 hours, but someone should come along hopefully very quickly. Yeah, Nicole is, and they're bandaging them up, which is good. Excellent. We are, luckily, uh, on our way to finishing off researching the hospital bed. We'll also research sterile materials. I thought it was lumped into one, I just assumed wrongly. Uh, and then we'll build some hospital wings, which should be good. Um, I'm very also conscious of the fact that we're relying on these doors, and if they ever get broken down, well, guess what's going to happen? We're going to die very quickly, so I want to probably put some defences in. So I'm going to go over to over to security and to steel mini turret, and I'm going to place some steel mini turrets around the place. One there, uh, one um, there, actually, one there and one there because that'll cover both that them doors and that door and then finally one so about there should be fine as well and then those will hopefully um, protect this quite a bit I mean you never know I might go all horribly wrong but we'll see cargo pods have landed nearby we'll have a little look and it is full of Algarve fruit. Algarve fruits. Nice. We'll pick that up at some point. So, people are going to go about their daily business. Um, we now have that mechanoid. Um, we only have one person, I believe, however, on crafting. Yes, I want to put... Um, Cougar the medic. Well, primarily on... Doctor, even though they're, they're a medic, but their skills is actually the same, or, or less than the collector, which is just dandy, isn't it? I think we'll say one like that. One for doctoring, one for crafting. The medic, same again. <laughs> the medic, who has got half the same amount of skill as the collector, and does not have a passion for healing either. <laughs> Great. Um... Okay, there we are. We should have people more assigned to medic a bit more. I believe this here it will do the ones first, then the twos, then threes, then fours. Um, actually, is the four? There is four. Um, but I think it is still left to right. So I, in terms of, I could be wrong. Please correct me if I'm wrong. But you can see here, Rodriguez. It's doctor and crafting is both level one. How do they pick which one they need to do? I think it's still the priority level over here. So if that's one there and one there, it still uses the left one. I assume that's how it works. It may not. We'll move on. So, that's all correct there. Tube television is in, so they can watch that. We're just finishing off the wooden chairs there. We are building some of these things, but it does require some more steel. But we do have quite a number of that. 412, which is good. We have set someone to disassemble the mechanoid rather we have ordered the disassembly of the mechanoid someone has not yet uh, gone ahead and done that in terms of our mission we've got six guns of various quality ranging from normal to good which is well just that good so hopefully we'll have a little bit of a less rougher time when it comes to events because it's um well the storyteller has been not entirely great for us has it so they're healing up, that's fine. You can see they're pretty much sorted. People are going about their daily business. So we need to think about a medical wing. So this area here will be expanded upon to the right. And eventually we'll have a medical wing, I think, down here. So what I'll probably do first is I'll wait for the defences to be built, which they should be. In fact, the problem with this stuff here is that they're not getting hauled. Um, purple is currently on cleaning first, I think. Let me double check him. Purple. Cleaning is one, yes. Hospital bed's finished. I will now research a sterile materials. Oh, I've research, research sterile materials, that's fine. Um, looks like Cougar's up and 
up and about now. Uh, we've got a mad rat. A local rat has gone mad. It is down there. It did say rat, singular, not plural, multiple of. Um, draft purple and draft cougar. And we'll just wait here. There we go. And is that rat fine? Yes. That's not the mad rat. It is turning around. <laughs> it saw what happened to its friend and decided to nope right out of there. <laughs> okay. So it looks like the mechanoid has actually been disassembled. I'm guessing we've got some plasteel off it because it's there. So this is good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to the structures and to the uh, sandstone wall and we want to build some more rooms and again like before it's going to be a clone of all of these other rooms here like so we'll put the door on it first that'll be the initial set of orders we'll let them go ahead and do that we will be able to put a carpet in it because we have uh, over 2,000 cloth so this is good this is good indeed uh, food yeah doing quite good again 2222 beer Ooh, two, two, two. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's symmetry there, at least. So that's good. Um, we have not got those turrets, and I don't know why. Oh, that turret is now placed, which is good. Its explosion radius is, I believe, well, not as big as that, so it shouldn't take out the power plant. And if it does, we've still got lots of battery backup anyway. We have a raid. Okay, so we have a raid that's uh, Greyhound, um, Kate, Sleepy, Gaz, Jules, Doug, other assorted bandits and such, and hired goons. Do we have anyone outside of the compound? We do not, so it should be a simple matter of waiting then. So I'm not really too bothered. What I will do, however, is I will keep an eye on people, because if they go outside... What happens is they see, they can see where the entrance ways are, and then they'll tend to smash them down. But let's see. Caro and Cougar are still working. Well, sorry, my mistake. Uh, Caro is working, and Cougar's sleeping in the medical area. They're not really doing much. They're just having. A little wander there. And eventually they will come to assault. Cougar the medic is fully healed. This is good. Everybody's asleep and now they are beginning their assault. However, it looks like they're beginning their assault around the standard defensive area. So it's not going to take too long for this to deal with itself, really. <laughs> and it looks like Sleepy is trying to bat their way out of the door. And they've done just that. Okay, so we'll uh, move all of that. There are two people here who we could try and rescue. I say could, we're not gonna. Um, there we go. And then we'll let them deal with that. Excellent. So, that um, managed to defend itself. Rodriguez has got starvation. Why? You can literally get up and get a meal right next door, which you have just done, and now eating, so we don't have to deal with that. Right, so I want Lan to get and prioritise the building of that sandstone door. It is imperative that we get that done. It's also imperative that we... Uh, imperative that we get these defences built back up. And they're going to go ahead and do the traps anyway, which is good. As always, we will try and chop wood and chop all of the wood inside our own compound, which there isn't any. So. Do we have enough wood stored anywhere? We have a total of uh, 99 wood stored, so no, not enough to, to really do much there. Sterile materials have just been finished, so this is good. Let me just go back to chop wood. It's interesting, we haven't got much wood to chop around here. There we are. So we need a research project. Um, mortars could be good. Could be good. Package survival meal, good for travelling. We do need to travel quite far at some point. Um, Mortars. 
gas operation, gas operation, yeah, because the auto can turret and multi barrel weapons and like sniper rifles, because we probably want to start doing that anyway. Okay, that's fine. We'll do that. But at least now we have that proper flooring in. So I'm going to. Oh, apparently a pirate merchant from the northwest known pronounceables is here. This is good. We can hopefully sell them a lot of food. Um, so I want to actually have purple. Prioritize working the crematorium, please. There we are. Uh, did it say they're visiting or passing by? I think it did say visiting, so they should go in that door. Yes, they are. Yes. That's fine. So we'll have a chat. We'll get Nicole. Nicole being our socialite. And we'll have a little chat. Hello there. So, they have a cobra for sale. They have also... Grey Counselor, human, male, age 44. Coyote Collector, human, female, age 37. And... Tiri, Marine, Human, Female, Age 47. They have some medicine, which I will buy. They have some tea that I will give them. I will also give them some uh, wake-up stuff as well. We all want to sell that to them. Uh, they do take beer. They will happily take beer. Now, the question is, um, do we want to buy slaves? Well, we don't really want to encourage the use of a slave trade. But we are buying their freedom, essentially. Um, so, the counsellor. 12 in social. Everything else, pretty garbage. Annoying voice. <laughs> and all, most counsellors. Um, not ones that, you know, help you out for... I mean the ones that um, <laughs> work on the council or are in government. Um, not rather the ones that are uh, more... Um, Psychologists and things like that. Uh, we've tough, uh, thick skin, dense flesh, uh, durable bones, night owl. Okay. And also, uh, annoying voice. Ten starting bark garbled phrases. This predisposes others to dislike them. Okay. Uh, Coyote the Collector. Ooh, look at all them there. Teetotaler. Uh, avoids alcohol and pleasurable drugs and kind. Coyote's a nice person. He's a tendency to brighten everyone's day. Never insults others. Abandoned child machine collector. Welcome aboard, Coyote. And we've got Terry the Marine. Ooh, they like shooting then. Quick sleeper. Pessimist. Okay. Hmm. They are very, very good at shooting and melee though, aren't they? The vat grown soldier and a space marine. Uh Problem is, it's going to cost us to get Terry. 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 Hmm. <laughs> Not bothered about the counselor. Nah. However, other stuff. We have loads of gold. Um. So I want to get. Probably as much of their money off as I can while still getting these two. And I think we'll do just that. And welcome aboard, everybody! Hunter lacks range weapon. So, TV the Marine, you can have a shotgun. And Coyote. Uh, should really check the social. Hmm. <laughs> There's a lot of minuses in there. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Um, so, do the... So I'm checking uh, bio, sorry. Uh, shooting three, melee eight. Okay, so they are melee character. Uh, we don't have any melee weapons, so we will resolve that by building on the machining table, my mistake, on the table here, a longsword. We're going to have two of those. And we also want to start making things like flak vests. So we'll build... F Actually, I don't know what's better, flak vests or flak pants. I believe flak vests, well, flak vests go over all the stuff, so that's generally okay. We'll make three of those. 
Um, and we also do want to eventually start to make some more advanced weapons, but we don't currently have any advanced weapons. So I'm going to change these to, well, not medical anymore. Um, and it means that the priority of this has now went up because we have another two people. You can see they've all ran and start to uh, get stuff on them. They have tattered April. Let's check on Coyote then. They have um, a bearskin t-shirt that's garbage. Okay, and Rotiri, you have cloth travel wear. Wow, okay, we need to sort that out, don't we? Um, and a poor hat as well. So, we want to make a hat. We'll make a couple of parkas. Make some pants. Uh, and we'll make a t-shirt, actually. There we go. And we'll set them on the go. Excellent. So at least we have a one. Oh, we've just got a blight on the crops. Right, that has just wiped out loads of crops. It is... Gone all around here. The question is, do we want to... Try and cut the blight out? It is possible that we can save it. It's unlikely because of the how widespread it is, but we will attempt it. At least it's over on the right-hand side. This is good. Okay, in terms of work, um, plant cut. Go. Everybody's been ordered to cut the plants. Should hopefully come over and deal with this sooner rather than later. No, no. Don't be going to bed, don't you be going to bed. Prioritise. The cutting of the plant. Oh, but you can't because I've selected two people. Because apparently that's a thing. Go. I'm going to have to manually do this because every time they do one bit, they're then going to try and go to bed. And zzzt, there's been an explosion. And the battery is now on zero. Fine, that's something we want. Um, not at all. I don't think it's uh, going to happen, is it? If I can just cut that one, though, so it won't spread around there. Botched harvest, I don't care. Yeah, it's spreading. It's spreading. We're getting there. Um, I know Rodriguez hasn't had much sleep. I'm going to get them out. Yeah, you can see them. Trying to do the best. But we might be able to salvage this. Okay, it's not too bad. It's not actually bad as I thought. It's not spreading too much. Um, cut the plant there. Cut the plant there. Cut them ones there. Or oh, that one there. Yes... Yes. Yeah. Botched harvest. Yeah. If it's a blighted heal route, I certainly would not class that as medical grade. <laughs> There's going to be a minor break list on Rodriguez, I think. Oh, they're awake now. I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, no, 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 no. Prioritize doing that, please. Right, there's that dealt with. Fine. Okay. Um, and there we're sorted. Right, so... Um, where was this electrical connection issue? Um, I've obviously turned on an overlay somewhere. It's showing the, uh, the impressiveness of it. But I don't know what I've turned on. Anyway, um, batteries are charging up now. The problem is that these guns take quite a bit as well. And with these two in here... We are using quite a bit now. Rodriguez with to break risk. I'm guessing tired. Yeah, drowsy. Okay. That's totally understandable, to be fair. Anyway, I think we'll leave it there. This has been an eventful episode. We have two new colonists. Welcome aboard. We have attacked and indeed uh, destroyed the ship and the uh, passengers, <laughs> its occupants. We've done some training. And we've had people turn up raiding wise and is that that is an armed boar 
Oh, Sal. Jill's got a gun. There you go. Hogs of War, I believe, was the PS1 game. Never played it. <laughs> got Rick Merlin, by all accounts. Anyway, <laughs> apart from that little juncture, uh, I think we're going to knock it on the head there. Uh, next episode, we'll go ahead and crack on. We will uh, try to see where all the power's being used. We'll finish off these bedrooms and generally just progress on. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings. <laughs>